did. I've been sitting here stuffing my face with some of the freshest caviar and oysters I have had in a very long time. And baby, y'all missed it. I was just about to head right home before y'all popped in. Hold up, hold up. Let me just get one more hors d'oeuvre and another glass of champagne. And then I have one more stop before I head home. It's another beautiful day out and I am happy for it. I've been enjoying my little solo dates more and more, y'all. It feels like the more I get to know myself, the more open I am to letting someone new, you know, get to know me. Loving yourself by yourself sometimes is what it really takes to get you back in the right headspace. I actually spoke to my last date again, and he did apologize for the combo. But that first date will indeed still be the last date. To be honest, I wasn't tripping on the combo. It was his response to me not being into something that he clearly was. Okay, so off topic transparent moment. My name is not Latrice, it's Shy. Look, look, in my defense, I didn't really know y'all that well, but now that we meet again, I feel comfortable telling y'all my real name. Mm -mm, don't do that. Don't act like you never gave a fake name to someone you just met. Mm-hmm, exactly. Anyway, if y'all haven't seen my date night recap, uh, why the hell not? Go check it out. I promise I kept it short and sweet. After my last date, I had to have an honest moment with myself and come to terms with the fact that I don't know what I actually want in a relationship. I feel so confused when I try to think of the type of man and relationship that I want. Sometimes I feel like I want a one-on-one -on -one relationship, then sometimes I feel like, why the hell should I limit myself to just one person? Then I go back to feeling like, nah, one is enough. I don't know, y'all. Anyway, the universe has been more than kind when aligning me with the correct man, although I must admit, there have been times that I've seen the red flags and still dropped it like it was hot. Uh-uh, don't do that. Judge yourself and not me. Okay, I know, I know. I need to make up my mind, but I have so many variations of what I feel like I want and need that maybe, just maybe, one person couldn't fulfill it or be able to maintain their sanity agreeing to it. Yes, I want the basic relationship things, but I also want my space. Like, um, I don't want to talk to or see you every day. I don't know. Y'all, I guess if I met somebody I really liked and we were able to share great intellectual combo, I probably would be okay with talking to or seeing them every day. See y'all, confusion. I'ma just keep enjoying myself. And when it's time for me to meet that person for me, I know that him or them will have and be everything I need.